Uh, my name is Abbas Samnani. I'm an assistant professor of uh, electrical engineering and computer science at the University of Toledo. And I'm the director of Adaptive Radio Frequency and Plasma Lab. We call it ARPL. So plasma is the fourth state of matter. It's about charged gases. And we are specifically interested to use plasma for and tuning and controlling and radiating electromagnetic waves, especially high power waves that are more difficult to be controlled by you know, traditional uh, technologies like semiconductors or MEMS or those kind of things. And so we have a couple of projects with Office of Naval Research ONR. In one of those, uh, we are trying to make uh, plasma matching networks for electrically small antennas. The electrically small antennas are those that we are using them at frequencies much lower than the resonant frequency. And matching of those uh, is, is a big challenge, has been a problem for decades. And the reason is that uh, they have a very specific kind of input impedance. Uh, so one technique to matching of those uh, antennas is using a negative capacitance so another project that we have with ONR is about uh, protection of electronic systems against high power microwave and those kind of things. So traditionally, limiters, specifically uh, plasma limiters, they are wide band. So when they are on, and so they shut off, you know, a broad range of spectrum. But modern systems, they need uh, very selective limiters and protection sheets so that when there is a thread at one specific frequency, you just shut off that, that frequency range and let the rest of the system work. And this is exactly what we're trying to, to do here uh, by integrating our plasma technology into some specific topologies to reach that. Uh, Another project that we are working with National Science Foundation, NSF, in which we are trying to use our high Q resonant structures, microwave resonators, to generate very efficient and low power consumption plasmas, specifically plasma jets, because plasma jets uh, are, are very important for some applications, like, uh, you know, plasma medicine, disinfection, uh, in, in larger volume for propulsion and those type of things. And we also have another project with Lockheed Martin Company in which we are trying to make again uh, plasma matching networks for very miniaturized systems. Uh, so in all of these, what we are doing is trying to control electromagnetic properties of plasma by controlling its electron density, pressure and, and, and size and integrating, you know, that very dynamic medium into our electromagnetic devices and systems so that we can tune and control and radiate electromagnetic wave in the way that like.